What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Game Channel. My name's AJ Gals. How y'all doing? We are back with Red Dead Redemption 2. We're uh, walking into into campus. There's a, a party going on. There's a, they were celebrating the return of Sean McGuire. Uh, if you, any of you uh, turned up for the stream, um, I'm, I don't want to say it was an abject failure, but it could have gone better. Uh, mostly because it had to end uh, probably about an hour early because I ended up uh, hitting a glitch and was just frozen in place and had to uh, basically go back to my save point. Uh, I went back to the save point and uh, couldn't find the Arabian horse again, so I have to go back and hunt for that fucking thing all over again. Um, I didn't kill the legendary buffalo, so that's the thing still roaming out there. We'll, we'll get that out. We'll get that thing on camera sooner or later, and, uh, I just never got, uh, you know, did any missions, I did a bunch of side stuff, so, um, given all that, and, uh, how weird the recording is when I record off of a stream, I'm still trying to figure some stuff out with that, um, I'm still, I'm still trying to, still trying to figure some stuff out with that, either way, um, Either way, so uh, seeing that I had to run back, I decided to uh, just re-record re this bit. So we're uh, we're actually going to do missions here in camp. So how's how's that sound? All right. Um, yeah, that uh, that about covers uh, the stream. I I don't know. It was fun, but uh, you know. Well, you know, streaming at uh, eleven in the morning. I don't know. I had a smaller audience than usual. Uh, either way, we're uh, we're streaming again tomorrow night. Um, I believe uh, seven to nine is my plan. And uh, we'll be doing uh, some Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Well, I'm just going to sit here and chug whiskey. As far as I can tell, I've never been able to make him, to make Arthur pass out. Basically, there are just times throughout the game that you just sit in, uh, in camp and you party. You just walk around and you get drunk. And talk to people. It's just all this trying to make the, uh, the camp seem alive and moving and whatnot. Let's check out this book. It just activates a... Uh, just a, like a fetch quest to see if we can find any of those for Hosea, because he likes those kind of like just little short mystery novels. Similar thing with um, with Jack. You can try and find um, children's books for him. I know this song. A book on... Basically a book on um, agriculture and all that. And... Ah, there we go. Book on, on the animals. All right, let's uh, let's sleep until morning and get this uh, get things rolling. Hunted a couple animals on our way over. I'm gonna turn into Pearson. Turn to Pearson in the morning, so hopefully we'll have uh, plenty of food here at camp. You know, guys, I am sorry that I haven't been uh, I haven't been playing this game probably as much as I should. I, I while I absolutely love the crap out of this game, um, I don't know. I, I've just maybe I played so much of it, I kind of burned myself out on it a little bit. Let's see here, bighorn sheep carcass. 
couple of turkeys. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Really, we're not full of meat. Fine, whatever. See, uh, let's go see Charles. What you prepare for? The greatest of gifts. An unguarded stagecoach. No, you simple-minded fool. Bison. Bison? Bison. How much you can get anything? There's some over on the plains, I believe. I saw a couple a long way off. Oh. Right? Good luck. You want to come with me? I'll show you how we hunt one. Sure. Why not? There's really not a. Uh, it's really not a not a special process to hunting a bison. It's just it's just hunting a bison. Oh wait, I also didn't. Uh, I, I forgot to mention. I also didn't pick up the. Uh, if anybody again watched the stream, I didn't pick up the Lancaster repeater. My mother used to tell me stories of how her tribe moved with the bison. They lived almost as one. The bison went. My people went. They were the center of all life. We couldn't survive without them. They provided us with everything. Food, clothing, shelter, tools. There was a lot of respect. Huh. I don't remember much of my childhood. But I think my people, well, we pretty much moved with the whiskey. <laughs> well, my father did that too. Let's try over here to the left. I don't know. Basically, what I was saying, though, is I uh, just, um, yeah, I don't know. I just kind of got into some other games, and uh, I'm nowhere near as far in this game as I should be. I you see them all? See, I have this weird thing with where uh, I really start playing games. We should only kill one of them. I'll keep them ringed in, and you see if you can bring one down. Okay? Clean as you can. Okay. You know, this thing, when I when I uh, start playing games that I love, that I, at some point, I almost get scared to keep playing because I don't want to, um, I, because it's almost like I don't want to finish the game. If that, you know, if that... I, I know it's, a, like, a weird thing to say. It's like, oh, I don't want to finish this game and it's not it's not because i you know like the game is bad or anything like i don't want to finish it no it's just i'm i want it to last forever Easy now. Well Good boy. Shh, shh, shh. all right skin and butcher take the horns too it can all be used God, I love I love watching the the animal skinning animations. Um, but yeah, that's it. That's really my my reasoning for why we uh, why I really haven't been playing this game a lot lately. It's just um, good job. Stow that on your horse and mount up. I want to go check something out. Okay, let's go. Where are we going? I thought I saw some scavenger birds over here. He just runs right over the corpse. No. Look. Bison. Shot and left for dead, it looks like. Why would someone do that? I don't know. But I see tracks heading in this direction. I say we follow him. Alright. Lead the way. Come on, Charles. Lead the way. Could it have been an animal? No, they've been shot. I just don't know why anybody would just leave them here to rot like that. You know, I, I've always another dead bison on the hill to the right. Come on. You know, I've always thought with stuff like uh, like sport hunting. You know, like so many people have dead again. have issues with it. There's a camp there. I'm gonna take a look. 
And, you know, I mean, as long as it's legal, you know, you've bought the permits and whatnot, you know, I mean, obviously I'm not saying, like, like wipe out populations or anything, but look, you know, uh, you know, you get it, you stuff, you, you know, you get the animal, you know, you have it stuffed, you get, you know, you kill the animal, and you, um, it, you know, you use its meat, uh, Basically, as long as you're not just, like, killing it and just leaving it out there. I, I really don't have an issue with it. But I hate the... I, but, you know, it's like this stuff. It's that uh, they're just killing the buffalo and just basically leaving them out there. That's just gross to me. Cold yet. Maybe half a day since they left. Bison's been dead about the same amount of time. So what do you want to do? They could still be in the area. Let's get up higher. See if we spot anything. Like I said, I know, I know so many, a lot of people have a, I know, I, I know people in like my own personal life who've got, who've got issues with hunting and whatnot, and I don't know, I think, I think with, as with most, you know, controversial subjects, I think there's, maybe another camp, um, it's worth a look, all right, let's go, you know, valid arguments on either side. for fun you think we can talk I don't kill for fun I kill when I need to yeah uh, Charles tell me that uh, again with what you're uh, you're about to do it has to be that come on wait up Fools shoot those bison. What's your problem? I said, did you fools shoot those bison? Calm down, you black or red bastard, whatever the fuck you are. Did you shoot them? Yes, we did. We shot them bison. We'll shoot you too if you don't get. What business is it of yours? What we? Oh, okay. Never mind. The guy pulled. I I didn't I didn't see that the guy pulled. I got a family. Never mind. Family. Don't shoot me. When you know he, when he said you know I only kill when I have to, sort of thing. I didn't see that the guy pulled the gun on him. What the hell are you doing? Why are you killing those bison and leaving them to rot? I don't know what you're talking about. God damn it, tell us and you're dead. Oh, okay. We were paid to kill as many as we could and make it look like it was Indians. Just kill him, Arthur. No, oh, please. Don't. I've heard enough. Damn right. That's what he deserved. I've seen enough of this. I'm heading back. Okay. I'm gonna see if there's anything worth taking from their camp. I'll catch up with you later. All right. I'll loot the camp and then we'll uh, we'll cut to when we get back over to. Uh... Oh, cool! We got po uh, poison knife pamphlet. Basically, t it teaches us how to craft uh, poison throwing knives. Like I was saying, uh, I'll uh, kind of loot the camp and then we'll reconvene back at uh, reconvene back at camp. There we go. All right, let's donate some stuff to Pearson. Yeah, I was about to say, you, really? Now here here's a crappy bison pelt. Take my this venison and this game meat. I suppose I can just pick up more of that. Jeez, our food is still in the red. Oh wait, I. I think I know why our food's in the red, and then we'll we'll talk about that at a at a later time. I'll show you guys what I what I mean. But uh, we need to complete a mission for uh, for Mr. Strauss over there. But 
now, looks like Javier actually Javier. has a thing for us. I heard about a house. Could be interesting. What kind of a house? I don't know. A couple fellas I heard in town, they said said it was really freakish. A family local boogeyman, I guess. But they're crooked in every way. So? Well, so these boys thought they were sitting on a lot of cash. And they're highway robbers, kidnappers, apparently. They're well hidden in the woods. That sounds pretty dubious. Well, of course, uh, yeah, it's dubious, but there ain't much risk of getting caught. Okay, then. Let's go take a look. Exactly. Just take a look. I don't like these like little little two man robberies that you can go on in camp. Again, it just it really builds. It's what I was talking about earlier at the party. It really builds the the this camp of characters. It it, it really kind of. He really makes them more than just NPCs. They, they're friends and they're family and they're... There's even some grudges and some hatred in there. But it's... It's a really neat dynamic that I don't... That I've seen other games try to do and try to, you know, simulate. But never as well as this game has. Let's stop and go on foot from here. Just up the hill this way. Follow me. Oh, I'm glad he grabbed a shotgun and a uh, shotgun and rifle. There's a spot up ahead where we should be able to get a good look at the place. I want to make sure we don't run into any surprises. Sure. Apparently, this family's been isolated for so long, they started talking in their own weird dialect. They really don't like outsiders, especially on their turf. Oh, well, you just keep selling me on this job, don't you? Oh, big place, right? Well, there's a pretty big barn in the back. Not a bad place to start looking. There must be a lot of people living here. A large house. Stash could be in any one of them buildings, and who knows how many people are in there. <clears throat> I ain't sure about this. Boy, I, I think we need to draw them out somehow, and... I got it. Ah, there we go. Throwing knives. Follow me. If I remember correctly, this is where I first got a war horse. One of the uh, one of the better breeds of horses. If you're gonna ride into danger, they have a high. Um, well, hopefully, it'll make it harder for them to spot us too. The coast seems clear so far. Yeah, so far. They're um, braver or something. Basically, the they spook. There's a lower chance that they, they'll get spooked. Come on, let's hide behind this shed. See if we can hear what they're saying. Maybe you hunt a pig this time with mouth. Creepers, Finn, don't score notions in the Jimmy Flemings head. Just stay quiet. Where you been now, noob? Don't be boiling now, Pappy. I has gone but ten minutes I was. Can holly gag all the now day long, cause Edie takes patrol now, don't you? What? No, Edie, get all the jam. You shut your gulper, or I'll flag her your felt, I will. Your niece will pull it up, boy. Up. Go guard the shed. 
Go! You understand what they're saying? Not much of it. What are we doing, Javier? Okay. You take cover by the rock over there. I'll create a little distraction, and then you jump them, okay? What kind of distraction? You'll see. Be quiet! Oh, he's burning the... Burning their shed down. to stand up to throw a throw a knife but oh great I don't know why I just started shooting I was going to try and stealth around There we go. Talking about guarding the uh, guarding the barns, it's probably somewhere here. Well, the chest in the barn is as good a place as any. Hundred bucks, jewelry bags. See his arm like keep popping through his jacket. Oh, well, look what we have here. I told you it was worth the trouble, didn't I? Yeah, you take this. Let's split up. I'll meet you back at camp. Sounds good. Hundred seventy five from that. Yeah, it looks like a um, decent horse. Tennessee Walkers. Damn it! Thought they had a uh, thought they had a war horse up here. Apparently, they do not. I could take that uh, paint horse, I suppose. Yeah. 
Yeah. Temporarily one and so one unbonded horse. Oh, that's interesting. With this being a race horse, that means this got uh, should have some wheels. I think it said that this was a yeah, this more of a racehorse. Uh, how far out from Valentine are we? We'll take it to the stables. We'll uh, bond it. Ooh, we'll also pick up that bounty before we head back to... Uh, Alright, looks like we'll be able to keep the Tennessee Walker. We'll uh, set this as our uh, main horse. Basically, it'll Swap over the, uh, I think it's called the tack. This is what all the, the saddle and all that. Eh, it's better, it's better than what we got. I kind of wish we had a war horse. Or, you know, I had the Arabian horse from, uh, up north. But, I'll, I'll find the damn thing. I'll find it eventually. I'm happy to stable that for you. Eh, grooming. Don't really need any of that. So, yeah, I'm not gonna really mess with. Nah, that'll work. To help the weak. Oh, it's you. There you go. Holster our guns. Don't need them for now. Yeah, I came up here to collect a uh, to pick up that bounty poster. Yeah, let's grab a let's grab a shave and uh, some food while we're over here. Oh wow, we got like 600 bucks now? Let's like play some poker. Alright. Interesting look, dude. Don't think I've seen you around here before. Should thank me. What's it to be? See, I of everyone I've talked to with this game, they've always said that they've, uh, you know, let Arthur's hair just grow out. I can't stand it, man. I I like him. I like his clean, you know, clean shaven, short hair look. Ain't no wild west no more around here. I also wish that we that we had the uh, the option to like bathe in the uh, in the rivers. That we'll see around, you know, that you see out and around. Kind of confuses me that we can't. Really thought I saw there was a. Uh, How do you do? An available bounty. Mister. Ah, oh, all right. Well, thought I saw, thought I saw a bounty. All right. Well, we'll uh, run back to uh, run back to camp and actually do actually do missions now. As long as uh, no one else wants our help with anything. You borrow from the O'Driscoll boys. You pay the O'Driscoll boys. I made it right with you. I swear. Well, I caught this riding out of town. Looks like this guy could use uh, use our help. Looks like you need. Uh, 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 pathetic. Uh, let's go. Uh, 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 oh, shit. I've been killing you fools since before I could remember. 
I'll try to help a guy out, and I think he ended up dead. Well, I tried. That's, uh... That's all I could say. Let's, uh... Yeah, there we go. Let's change so we're not all, uh... All muddy. We'll get back to camp. We'll uh, we'll talk to uh, talk to I think Leopold Strauss first. Basically, what Strauss does, like I, I, everyone in the camps, kind of got their own thing. I mean, Arthur, Bill, John, Javier, all them. I mean, for the most part, they're all just kind of hired guns. You know, kind of. Um, I don't want to say jack of all trades, but they're strong arm men. You know, they'll rob you blind, sort of thing. Uh, I know Mary Beth is a. Uh, we you find out at some point uh, she's a great pickpocket. You have Karen; she's really good as a um, kind of kind of goes in as a distract a distraction. She's kind of like an actress. Uh, Tilly's kind of the same uh, as both of them. You know, good pickpocket. You know, more smaller crimes, but still uh, a, a master in her own right. Uh, Jose and Dutch are con men. And then you have uh, Strauss, who is a moneylender. Technically, I guess his is a legal uh, form of business. But basically what Strauss will do is he'll, uh, you know, loan people money and then send Arthur after them to get it, you know, get it back. Hey, you're okay, girl. So, uh, sorry, so basically what I was trying to get at, basically what Strauss does is he um, sends us out to collect, um, collect debts. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. One of the girls saw that friend of yours, Mary Gillis, sniffing about. Mary? Yes, I never liked that woman, Mr. Morgan. Funny business. They're good boys, mostly. It's the mostly I'm scared of them. Um, How's it going? Mary's uh, an old flame of Arthur's. We'll we'll kind of get. Holy crap! I got a lot of. I was gonna donate some money, but I guess we'll just donate a bunch of pocket watches and rings. Man, how did I get all this crap? Jeez, ten dollar pocket watch. I'm gonna keep contributing. I mean, we still got plenty of other items. Wish you could do this a little faster. A Twenty five dollar, jeez, fifty dollar jewelry bags. All right. All right, you know, camp's got some uh, some pretty good money. All right, we'll go uh, pick up Leopold's mission. Basically, like I was saying, he um, sets a bunch of play a bunch of people that we can go uh, extort for. Well, I guess not extort, but you know, collect loans on. Uh, then we'll talk to Dutch after we're done with this. Mr. Strauss, you busy, my friend? Why? I'll cut you in. Loaning already. You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Roble, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there, badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Uh, I'll make sure they see it in them terms. <coughs> Excuse me. In the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. I just miss him so much. See, there's a... 
Pretty sure. Oh, we, uh, okay. I guess we have to go out and actually collect one before. Hmm. All right. I was going to go talk to Dutch, but I suppose we'll go. We'll collect the closest one, which I guess is this, uh, this robled gentleman and painted sky. Um, so far, every chapter I've played, uh, this one, the next one, and chapter, because what, this is chapter two? So, all of them have involved money, uh, have involved Strauss uh, sending you out to kind of play a debt collector. You and Sean seem to enjoy the party then? Oh, shut up. What did I say? <laughs> I don't think it's what you said, Arthur. It's what you uh, what you implied. God damn! I, I we're heading we're heading down to this river. I really want the fishing pole. And there, there's a it's a fun mission of how you get it. Um, I mean, it's not like some mystical thing like how you get the fishing pole. It's uh, from what I remember, it's you, you go fishing with Jack because um, oh my god, John's wife Elizabeth uh, was. You know, uh, wanted the kid to get out and hang with one of the guys. So she sends him out with Arthur, and he goes fishing with him. I mean, it was, it was a it was a cute little story mission. Um, has some larger implications for the game, but it's you know we'll get there when we get there. But I really enjoy fishing in this game. It's super relaxing. I only have one big issue. And that is when you get, like, the bigger fish, you know, like... I mean, like, you can catch, like, big, like, when you see the weight of them. There's, like, 15-some pound fish. You know, 15, 20 pound fish. Um, and, you know, you put them on the back of the horse. So, you know, like, you'll have, like, a perch, stra you know, like, strapped on the back of your horse. And you're looking at it going, you know, I could fit one or two more of those. Easily. Like, it's almost like they should be hung from the side of the horse, not on the back. And it's not like you can cut open fish and just take meat and scales and whatnot. You actually have to take the whole fish. Knock, knock, Mr. Robe. Oh, God damn it. English? Uh, you me, speak English? Me? Uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for you. Silesia. I'm here for money. Do you borrow from a German man? Aha, uh -huh. German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, the uh, Kaiserreich. I don't yeah? speak German, neither. I'm here for money. I understood, I understood some of that. You borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Aha. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh, Leopold Strauss. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. Is very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. Oh. Where is he? Oh. Oh. No. No. Nye. Nye. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Potrzebuję trochę czasu. Znajdę ci pieniądze. Oh, still don't understand you. Where is the money? Gold! Dollars! Nie rób tego! I have nothing! No! No, nie! Ah, no, 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 no! Please, no! Then give us the money! Yes. I have your things. Okay. I have anything in here or out there. Yes. All right. Let's loot the apartment. Very valuable. Good. Not good yet. I'm gonna walk around and steal what I can. Nice, nice fine brandy. Yes, yes, yes. Really, you're kind of mad that I took your booze. 
Longer I look, the madder I get. Nie rób tego! I need! I must eat! Proszę! Okay, that should about cover things. Yeah, but I'm gonna keep stealing. Unless he's got nothing. Seems like he doesn't have anything. Wait, wait. I missed, I almost missed this chest. And of course there's nothing in it. Well, I guess there's nothing in the rest of this freaking house. Like, I know if I keep searching, there's not going to be anything. But if I don't search, like, somebody's going to tell me, Hey, man, you missed uh, this really cool stuff. Because, you know, that's how, uh, that's how my life kind of works. Yeah, where are you, horsey? Come on, girl. And we'll collect those other debts as we uh, as we go. We'll head back to camp, deliver this, uh, deliver the debt payment, and then we'll we'll do that mission for uh, for Dutch before we close. All right, before we deliver this debt, let's. I got. I gotta say, I actually, I really like Bill in this game. <laughs> Getting real low on meat here. Ah, there we go. We've moved up out of uh, out of the red. And now we can access the ledger. Basically, this just shows all the uh, the contributions. And now we can also buy uh, buy restocks of things, or like this. Uh, so say we restock for fifteen, and this goes out of uh, camp funds. I don't know why it won't let me restock, but okay, so there we go. We purchased that upgrade, so like it says. And now we can resupply our stocks of medicine. On, Hal Morgan. Called in on the small holder, Robo. Didn't even speak English. Good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. <laughs> I know. Um, but yeah, that's just stuff that we can do around the camp. Oh, the the letter is here. So, so let's check out the ledger. I'll show you all the all the stuff that we can do um, with the ledger. So, like I said, you know, we can upgrade this stuff. Uh, we can restock. 
you know, we can uh, have better ammunition and whatnot. Actually, let's restock our ammunition. And then we can uh, give Dutch better lodging. And then as we boost du Dutch's lodging, and then we'll get more and more uh, for the camp. And we can also get a horse station, so uh, have more room to hitch horses, chicken coop, uh, so that dead, a will bo uh, dead Eye will boost when we consume the stew. We have leather working tools, so that um, you know, it gives us more crafting options. A lot, of, a lot of cool stuff that can be done. Just sitting around telling, telling ghost stories. Can I, uh, apparently I can't go in there and talk to Dutch. Oh, we can read that letter. That's from, uh, Apparently we can't sleep. We have to inspect the letter. There we go. Sleep till the morning. We'll talk to Dutch and get a and get a main mission. I. It's what I. It, one thing I love about this game is just there's always stuff to do and it's all really fun. But when I sit down and try and record I'm like all right I'm gonna I'm gonna sit and do missions and then I just get distracted all right let's see what Dutch has got for us Arthur Dutch Miss O'Shea well feels like we are finally getting back on our feet <laughs> you uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole not yet but Jose is working on it when we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. But they don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah! Dutch! Arthur! What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. They nearly lynched me. They... They got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging him. Here's open. What? <laughs> the fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but fine, all right. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah, of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur, no crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Oh, goody. I love the... I, lo I love I love the uh, getting Micah out of that jail, because getting him out of that jail is uh, interesting, shall we say. Didn't stop for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. <sighs> I'm beat. We finally get off that mountain, then this. Micah's got a crazy side off him. What were you boys yeah. doing? You are supposed to be scouting ahead for us. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was, you worried too much, kid. Just, just some business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them, Micah knew, drank some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. Man, he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. Happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. 
They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you gonna go get him? I'll come with you. No, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about Mikey. It was drink that started all this. We'll just have a cup. Settle you down, then head back, okay? Okay. Now, I should warn you. Me and a couple of the other boys, we got in a bit of a fight last time we was here. What kind of fight? Oh, uh, nothing big. No, we kept it clean. We're all good. Nothing big. We got thrown out a window. I think that, that fits my definition of, you know, big. <laughs> you know, I got plenty of cash. I should probably go pay my bounty. I can't tell if I... I, I keep going back and forth. Part of me likes the most zoomed in camera and part of me likes the second zoomed in. I'm not sure. Hmm. I'm going back and forth on the cam on my camera options. All right, if Lenny's following me, let's let's get into let's move a little fit move a little quicker. I cannot speak the English language. Up, oh, just ran over a guy. Oh, you're kidding me! I hate how that's a crime. I mean, I, I get it. But at the same time, really? I bump into a dude with a horse, and now the mission's over. Or, you bump into a horse, or, or you bump into a guy with your horse, and then now you're getting chased by the law, you have a $100 bounty, and you gotta waste a bunch of cash on that. Just one or two, right off of? Of course, just a drink, no big drama. Can we get a couple of beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. And you'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All it took for him to get Mike to, uh... to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy a stuff, but Mike... A lot of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, there, Dullards. My lord. You men is dull. <laughs> hey, leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People been leaving me alone for the last ten years. I'm... Hey, buddy, if you don't shut up, I'm gonna rip your head clean off your shoulders. Is that clear? Get out of here! Clear? Damn it, clear. I didn't see the beat option. Very clear. I'm on my way. <laughs> oh. I like how they at least make it so you can walk around when you're drunk in this game. Unlike uh, GTA, where you stumble around and just fall off cliffs. Oh, hello. You know, you know what I'm talking about. That stumbling around where you uh, you try and figure out where you're going, and then you walk into traffic. How was that?
you? Nobody. I'm talking to nobody. What did you say? What? I said, what did you say? Get off, buddy. Shut up, mister. Yeah. Shut your mouth, mister. <laughs> Oh, that's, that's great. That's what you want to see. I'm so proud of you, Arthur. You press the button to try and change it and it just makes him blink. See here. If I remember correctly, <laughs> it's Lenny again. <laughs> Shut up, Clyde. Lenny! Lenny! What are you talking about? Ugh, I hate this. Yeah, we can't go in those doors. Damn it, Lenny, stop slumping off on me! What? I ain't Lenny. Arthur. Arthur, what are you doing? Are we slapping each other? I thought he was about to try and ride that pig. <laughs> oh, he'll never take me alive. You know, last time I got caught, I'm not actually, you know, first time I did this, I got caught. I'm not really sure where he wakes up.
Oh, that's wonderful. And try to make amends with an old rival. Catch Lenny in the act. <laughs> Don't get arrested. I'm not sure what the amends are. Was it... Did, did it not want me to drown that guy? Where exactly, are we? I got a stranger down here by Flat Next Station. <laughs> we are absolutely nowhere near our horse. Um... Yeah, you know, we can take a rest. Uh, you know what, guys? For now, we'll close things out. I want to say, as always, thanks so much for watching. Facebook, Twitter, the website, minds.com. Links to all that stuff is down in the description below. Uh, tell me what you want to see next. You know, do you want to see some stranger missions? Do you want to see me go hunt down the rest of the uh, the gunslingers? Go help Micah? Uh, go see what's with that letter uh, back at camp? I'll do, eh, you know, any of those things. Just let me uh, let me know what you guys want to see next. And, uh, you know, help, help make the decision easier for me. And uh, I'll take all that into consideration. But uh, until then, guys, I want to say, as always, like, I thank you. Facebook, Twitter, the website, minds.com. Links to that in the description below. Like, comment, you're not already. Please subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned for my next time. But until then, my name's AJ Gels. Self-Dark Game Channel. I'm out.